Good day, this is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news and reviews. We have here a fitness tracker and it is using the Deep Fit application. And by request, we are going to have a demo on how to pair or set up the Deep Fit application on the Android platform with this fitness tracker. So if you have any questions regarding the installation or pairing of a wearable to the Deep Fit app on the Android platform, just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if we do have the time. Okay, let's start and pair our fitness tracker with the support app Deep Fit on the Android platform. If you have the user manual, you can scan the QR code on the user manual or you can just search here on the Google Play Store the Deep Fit application. Okay, so we have here the app. So we have Deep Fit. 50,000 downloads. We have 50,000 downloads. And as you can see here, it was updated last December 20, 2023. Okay, just last month or two months ago. Okay, so let's install the application and see the features, additional features for our fitness tracker. So, tap on install and let's wait. We have 61.09 MB. Okay, so we are already on the 85, 87%, 94, and we are now installing the application. So let's open the app. Time for change. We have here privacy condition. So let's agree to the user agreement, approve. So we have here an option to log in, sign up. In our case, we'll just skip, okay? It also has a support for several languages here. Then tap on skip, confirm, scan and pair to the device. Okay, so it's already asking us to pair our wearable to the support app. Yes. Deep fit is running. Is it scanning or not? Okay, plus a device manually. Approve. So we have here a permission allow deep fit to access this device's location on this time. Approve. We have another permission here. Determine in relative the relative position of nearby devices. Allow. And let's see. Okay, so we have here the fitness tracker. Already found the fitness tracker TK30. And we have here the MAC address. Is it our fitness tracker? So let's see. Let's go to our settings. Let's see if we have some information here. So we have the TK31508 or 1508. Okay, so this is our fitness tracker. Pair. It's now pairing. So let's wait. And we are paired successfully. So that's it. Okay. We have here the device. So we have here stop optimizing battery usage. Allow. Synchronizing. Let's wait for the synchronization. Okay, it has finished synchronizing and we are paired. So let's check on the settings here. So we have the TK30 firmware update reminder. Later on, we will update. So let's go with the basics here. Let's set up the notifications. So tap on notification. Let's activate the deep fit. Allow. Okay, activated. So let's pick here. Call notifications. Okay. We will grant permission. Allow deep fit. 
to access your phone call logs, allow it. Allow deep feed to access your contacts, allow it. Allow deep feed to make and manage phone calls, allow it. Okay, we'll block this one. Okay, it's from another app. We have Facebook. Let's activate this one, SMS. Okay, grant permission for the SMS. Twitter. Instagram and WhatsApp. Viber and Messenger. Okay, so that's it. Go back. Let's activate our sedentary reminder. Watch face style. So we have an option here. Although here in the smart band we don't have that. So it's available here in the support app. Watch face style. Let's try. Okay, so we have different watch faces here or dials. So let's pick one. Let's choose this one. Set as the current watch face. Again, you can only download one watch face at a time. This is due to the limited memory of the fitness tracker. It is now setting up. So let's wait. Still 0%. It's now loading. As you can see, our fitness tracker here switched to download mode. Okay, setting up 100% and finish. And we're done. Let's see. And we have here our new watch face. Okay, so very simple UI for our deep fit app. Right screen duration. What else? Okay, nothing else. That's it for the options for our fitness tracker. And we have here some help. You can activate if you want. Okay, go back to the UI. We have here the home. It is where the okay, different health functions for our smart band. Okay, you can check here the details. The graph and the statistics as you can see here. Mine, this is for the personal settings, your profile. You can change it here. Steam, skin tone. We have the units here. You can also change from 24 hour to 12 hour format time. Let's set this one. Okay, we have now the 12 hour format time. You can change to metric or imperial Celsius to Fahrenheit. And we have an option here to connect to other third party platform. We don't have it here so far. Goals, you can set your goals here. 10,000 steps. And I guess that's it for our TK30 fitness tracker. Let's update this one. Start upgrading. So that's it for our pairing of the deep fit application on the Android platform. Okay, very easy, very simple, very direct. We have some few settings that we have set. We also have an option for 12 hour or 24 hour to 12 hour format time. Option to download watch faces as well as Settings for the SMS, app notifications, and call notifications. Again, if you have any questions regarding the this video tutorial for the pairing of our Deep Fit app on Android platform, just drop a comment below and we will try to answer your queries if we do have that time. Goodbye.